Okay, so so our elbows are moving a little bit, right? Yeah. It's really you know, and it, it's hard because people always tell you don't move, hands still, but the hands have to go forward and back with the horse's motion. Okay, right. And you see, so you're trying to do your little jerks. <laughs> okay, so let's get her lower. <clears throat> She needs to go lower, like that, down, yes, like that, easy, good, All right, and then we're going to keep her low, and we're going to pick up your trot, good, All right, so remember, the lower you keep her, you'll be able to capture that little head toss, it's just a habit pattern that's got to be removed, draw reins, once a week, <clears throat> so, she's, why is she so much better to the right? Because all horses have one side, they're all right hands or left hands. Okay, but what does that mean? So we need to work more on the other side. Why is that? I don't know. I'm, well, probably I'm weak. Well, look at her. She's so soft to the right. And every time you ride her to the left, I'm like, bend her left, bend her left, bend her left. She's already bent right. It's because she's bent right. So she's, you know, she's softer. You know, you, she's got the little softness in her neck because she's bent right. So let's go a little bit lower. So this is what you need to get to the left. Right, good. Anyway, so this, this canter, we're gonna, you're gonna sit and you're gonna canter. You don't, when I say sit, I don't mean like, you know, necessarily a full seat, okay? So now you have to get her on the bit of the canter. So how are you going to do that? You got, first your elbow's got to follow forward and back, right? And then you've got to bend. She is bent right. So your outside rein's going to say here, so, it's so hard, Sandra, Sandra, right? Go down, right? She needs to go down to go round there, down to go round, okay? But your elbow's got to go forward and back. That's all right. Anytime she breaks, always go back to a really nice trot. Good. Let's go to your sitting trot. She needs to have a lo longer neck. <clears throat> and you can make your circle at least 10 feet bigger towards the jumps. And then you're going to dip into your inside stirrup and ask her to canter. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. <laughs> Easy. <clears throat> oh. Right. So you got to think like rider towards the outside, right? Like your leg yielding out. Free up the inside shoulder, right? Long neck, right? Good. Maybe a little counter bend. It's all right. You know, if she breaks, it takes the wrong way. Try not to pull her up like that, okay? okay. Even even your corrections should be done with finesse, all right? No. Nope. So let's try. Um, I gotta think here for a minute. We're gonna go to the right. 